உங்களுக்கு <laughs> Yeah. 
இப்போ வந்து இம்பீரியல் பைலட்டாக இது பண்ணணுமா ரெபல் பைலட்டாக பண்ணிக்க கிடையாதுங்க Lord Vader's orders are clear. Are they? Yes. Wipe out all that remains of Alderaan. How? I understood the survivors were in hiding. Intelligence reports a possible Alderaanian convoy heading to Fostar Haven. You are to draw them out and finish them off. Do you understand that, Captain? Perfectly, Commodore Sloan. Dismissed. on their way. They're excited to fulfill Lord Vader's command. And you? No qualms hunting down refugees from a world we destroyed? During the Iskalon uprising, you taught me to ignore propaganda. They're traitors, not refugees, and will be dealt with accordingly. I've prepped our usual Sigma-9 loadout. No. Yeah, I'm standardized today. Right, but I don't know. I don't know. This might be a new town after all. <laughs> you hear me, Teresa? But I don't think you understand me. I guess we'll find out. Follow my lead. And don't fire unless I give the order. The convoy is out there. We don't want to scare them off. Let's do this right. <coughs> Another victory is at hand. Systems. All right. 
Okay, do we need it? Hundred percent age, try to plug into screen. All systems up and running. Inside, you forget how big our Star Destroyers really are. Careful. The shields won't harm us. But flying so close to the hull is no time to get careless. Sir, it is good to fly old school again. There's something very forthright about a TIE fighter. Someone is testing battle formations. Better here than in the field again. Distance helix. Those engines run hot enough to vaporize a tie. Hmm. I've known a few daredevils who found that out the hard way. Tie pilots push the limits. Sometimes the limits push back. They're off course. Good. All systems calibrated, and the fleet is in good shape. Vigilance reports our Gozanti transport is ready. Helix Squadron, head to the Gozanti and dock for hyperspace jump. 
Certainly. Follow down below the Gazachi so its locks can engage. Squadron and docked and clear for hyperspace jump. Remember, Helix, we'll have support. But finding the refugee convoy is up to us. They won't escape the Empire twice. Hyperspeed. Okay, hyper jump for the idea. Blockade is forming up. Our rear guard is secure at least. Interesting. There's a lot of cargo traffic today. Then our convoy might be hiding among them. Agreed. All cargo vessels. This is Captain Lyndon Javes of the Galactic Empire. Prepare for immediate inspection. And this is Vostar Haven Station Master. Kindly avoid harassing my customers. If they cooperate, they'll be fine. Pilot, proceed. Acknowledged. Check your forward sensor. It will identify potential targets. Pilot, begin by inspecting that ship.
customers are legitimate traitors. You have no right. Captain, the station's defenses just activated. Helix Squadron, destroy those turrets. We can't search under fire. Out here, no one shoots unless they're prepared for return fire. Even the Empire should know that. EMP burst up.
Damn it! Pilot, see if you can bypass his shutdown. <laughs> Shields. Right. We might need to hold out a while. We better. Systems check complete. In formation. Echo 3, matching formation. Echo 2, standing by. Echo 5, standing by. I'm on your wing. needs to stock up now. Head to the U-Wing for resupply. Thank you. 
Admiral, we're here. Yeah, but the convoy's way over there. With the bad guys between us and them. Echo Squadron, transfer all power to engines. Head below the Star Destroyer and wait for my signal. It's risky, but flying fast and close to the Star Destroyer's hull should get us to the other side safely. Steady. Hold. Thrusters! Squadron, there's a quasar bearing down on the convoy. And filled with reinforcements. Take the ties down. Well, that's a medicine, beautiful sight. Corvette Captain, focus on the quasar. We'll 
saved a lot of innocent lives. And mine. Cowboy's ready to jump. Thank you. We'll tell everyone what the Rebel Alliance did for us. All ships, prepare for light speed. We all choose our path. Light or dark. Freedom or destruction. The Empire chose to destroy Alderaan in order to spread fear and douse the fires of rebellion. But the heroic pilots of the Rebel Alliance have chosen to keep fighting it, to show the Empire that we are not afraid. It was their bravery that ended Palpatine's reign and brought about our new Republic. However, the Empire lives on, shattered though it may be. As I speak, Imperial forces are edging toward the Bormia sector, hoping to end our new Republic before we find our footing. As their Empire collapses, they try to tighten their grip. But the galaxy is changing, and you can be a part of it. With the help of brave and daring pilots, this war can end. Make a choice. Fly with the New Republic. Change our galaxy for the better. Vanguard Squadron to Temperance. Do you read us now? Had some trouble with our long range comms. You're the third patrol reporting. Calm blackouts. Head on back, Gunny. The commander will want a full report. Lousy comms. Chasing our tails for hours, and now we're late to meet the new boss. Well, do you want to race home, Chris? We might make it before his speech ends. <laughs> <laughs> Keo, I ain't racing you. I learned my lesson the first 12 times. <laughs> Ash, the speech is starting. I'm not one for speeches. So I'll just say, I'm honored to assume command of the Temperance in this fleet. Vanguard squadrons Reputation for bravery and integrity is unrivaled. Which is why, effective immediately, we have been reassigned to an initiative codenamed Project Starhawk. Starhawk? Then those rumors about a secret project are true. What do you think it is, huh? Some kind of weapon? The key to victory. If it helps end the war, who cares? I care. I like to know who I'm working for. The good guys, Chris. Remember? The only people in the galaxy who don't have a death mark on you? <laughs> ah, Grace. The day ain't over yet. <sighs> Come on. Back to the temperance. We can meet the new boss. And anyone else he's bringing along. said to expect you. I'm Zarel the Sage, Chief Mechanic, and this here's the Temperance, my pride and joy. I imagine you're excited to join the action. Speaking of, here's the rest of your squadron. Hey, Gani, I got your new pilot over here. You go ahead, I'll meet you in there. Welcome to Vanguard Squadron. I'm Kyra Kuva. You can call me Gunny. Happy to have you on the team. Let's talk after the briefing, yeah? You're joining one of the best outfits in the New Republic. Hope you can live up to it. Anyway, follow them into the briefing room. I think our new commander's waiting for you in there. Huh. You arrived. Excellent. Otto, meet our new Vanguard Five. Oh, the one who saved your skin at Foster Haven. 
Ardo Baradai, Fleet Intelligence. A pleasure. I heard they rewarded you with a posting to Chandrilla. A real honor. Very safe. But a good pilot shouldn't just gather dust. I needed people I can trust. And I figured you'd want to get back into the action. Huh. <laughs> There's no shortage of that around here. Right. Let's get you briefed. Welcome back to the front line, Vanguard Five. As you've no doubt experienced, the Empire is jamming communications across the sector. <laughs> I fear these blackouts could be a prelude to invasion. Vanguard Squadron, I need you to split up to solve this. Chris and Grace, bring our new pilot to the Brental Systems borders. The scouts we sent to investigate haven't reported in. Find out what happened to them. Then regroup with your squadron near the planet Cavus. Gunny and Keo, that's where you're headed. If I were still an Imperial, well, I'd send jamming ships there. Knowing the Empire, I expect they're using these jamming vessels to disrupt our long-range comms. They'll have TIE squadrons in tow. Destroy all Imperial squadrons and jammers. Communications must be restored for Project Starhawk's future. When you've succeeded, regroup and return to the Temperance. Let's see how you do, Vanguard Squadron. Got a moment. Hello. Grace Salia Vatara Sina. Grace, if you like. It's a pleasure. I've been with Vanguard long enough for Gunny to trust me with second position. And she doesn't trust easily. Especially those from Imperial families. Well, everyone finds out sooner or later. Yes, unfortunately, my dear estranged family builds TIE fighters for the Empire. And I take great delight in blasting those fighters to Stardust. I trust you will too. <laughs> See you out there. I'm Kyo Venzi. Welcome to Vanguard Squadron. You'll do great things with us. Trust me. This is an amazing team. I went from semi-pro racing to fighting the Empire. Quite a change. But everyone in Vanguard lifts up the others. You'll fit right in. Whatever this Project Starhawk is, I suppose the commanders will tell us when they're ready. But for now, we have scouts to find. According to the battle plan, we aren't flying together on this mission. But you'll be on my wing sooner than later. Okay. See you out there. See you guys. Good evening. Finally, chance to get acquainted. Like I said, the name's Gunny. Stay sharp, keep your nose clean, and we'll be off to a good start. We had calm blackouts like this right before the Empire invaded Mimban. Lost a lot of friends. But I learned to shoot a blaster. You'll be flying with Frisk and Grace today. Meet them if you haven't. The best advice I can give you is this. Stick with your squadron. It's simple, but sometimes hotshots and lone wolves need to hear it. Get to your ship. Mission already? Good. I'm not one for waiting around. Got an X Wing ready for you here. A real beauty if you need. Sorry. The droid's giving me the eye. Little rust buckets are always planning something, right? I was gonna say, if you need anything for that shiny star, we should run a pre flight check on your X Wing. Climb into the cockpit when you're ready. Nice to meet ya. Squad calls me Frisk. Only Grace calls me by my real name. And only when she's mad. I know it's not often you find a handsome fella like me fighting for the Rebellion, or New Republic, or whatever we are now. 
I used to be in what you might call acquisition until I got that. How was I supposed? That's what's great about this place. If you're ready to go, just hop in the cockpit. Okay. Ah, the X-wing, backbone of the Rebel Alliance and our New Republic. A good old rounder that'll stand up to any. I'll get it ready. Tell me what you need. If you're ready to go, just hop in the cockpit. Okay. Hmm. Power management systems. Check. All right. I'm loading in your astromech droid now. Keep an eye on it. Once you find our missing pilots, all right. See you soon. Good luck, you two. Our jump point's just ahead. Hyperspace coordinates calculated. Engines are hot. Okay, Let's do this, Vanguard Squadron. Okay. I know it's 
it's macabre, but we need you to lock onto the wreck and get close. Such brutality. Even that astromech got dusted. Someone really didn't want these scouts getting home. Hey, I'm picking up a second signal. Let's check it out. Follow me. Gaudam, char cheer than par. Gaudam, the nala kalan dekum do che. Am pinna dekum je matu ka. for the Empire's jamming ships. If we scan the wreckage for its last known trajectory, it could lead us to the jammers. That's a heck of an idea. Vanguard 5, scan the debris and we'll watch your back. Ships. Shut the ingress. I'll soften him up. You two finish him off. 
That'll patch up your hull and stock up your ordnance. Follow me. Stick together. Vanguard, we have an Imperial cruiser protecting the last of the jammers. 
Taking down these ships ain't gonna be easy. Not while the cruiser has a missile launcher. We'll keep our countermeasures ready. What's our play? If we take out the jammers first, we can call the temperance for reinforcements. That's why you're in charge, Gunny. Vanguard 5, focus on the jammers. Affirmative. Here we go. Let's finish off the last one.
Empire won't push into our territory again anytime soon. Thanks to our new pilot. Yeah, and thanks to the rest of us. This isn't a race, all right? We're a team. You're right, Gunny. But still, nice flying out there. Speaking of fancy flying, I was thinking about the Dragon Void run from a few years back. You see that one, Keo? Oh, sure. I caught the whole thing on the hollow net. Yeah, me too. I watched the entire thing, but for the life of me, I can't recall who won. I think it was one of the Ash Twins. No, wait. Delon Vuk. Yeah, that's it. Boy, he was something else back then. In fact, the only pilot I've seen that comes close since is Keo here. Oh, come on. Delon Vuk's got nine championships under his belt. I've only got five. Well, fun as this is, Commander Javes has someone special waiting for us in the briefing room. Let's get in there and find out what's next. Commander's waiting. Where is it now? I helped Talus Group chase it away from a medical convoy towards Yavin. It's pinned in the upper atmosphere with no hyperdrive, but too many fighters for Talus Group to handle alone. This might work out for both of us. Come, meet our visitor. Wedge Antilles, Rogue Squadron. I hear you're the reason I was able to finally get a calm through. I have a Star Destroyer problem that Vanguard might be able to help me solve. We need a Star. As you may have overheard, Talos Group has cornered the Imperial Stardust. They're in tough, but it's present. So first, we need to give ourselves some cover. Naturally, if we can also take out the targeting system, that'll buy us even more time. Next, we need to prepare the Star Destroyer for boarding. You'll need to find a potential breach point once you find a good spot. However, we can expect that the Victorum still has. Once the skies are clear, while our troops capture the. Once the boarding team. Okay, I think I accidentally made stealing a. Sorry for the speedy introduction. Your commander says... The Star Destroyer? Aren't you tossing him in the deep end a little early, Linden? Vanguard can handle it. Can't you? Besides, Project Starhawk needs that Star Destroyer for... Well, you know. Wedge made a name for himself at the Battle of Yavin. He knows that system better than the Empire ever will. He'll be fighting on the river. <laughs> so, we're headed to Yavin. An exalted... And now we know Project Starhawk needs an... The commander wants you on an X-Wing for this mission. Got you outfitted with ion missiles. They disable enemy fighters and they'll disable... I'll get it ready. Looking for something specific? Be ready. <clears throat> Here. 
interceptors. Those have got to be the first to go. Agreed. They're fast. They'll rip right through our fighters. Vanguard, prioritize targets. I'm with you. Keep them busy. You're really gonna steal that Star Destroyer? That's the plan. Okay, Vanguard, on me. Let's head for the Victorum. Focus your shields before they open fire on us.
you on. Great work. Your wings are on their way. We can bring the boarding team in safely. Follow me to the rendezvous. We'll give them cover. Vanguard, let's go. Ready to take on a Star Destroyer? Copy, Captain Antilles. Just get us there and we'll do the rest. You heard him, Vanguard. Guide those U-Wings into position. Stay sharp. What about the Star Destroyer's crew? If our boarding party takes the bridge, they'll slice internal security systems. The crew will be a problem with no computer access and all the blast doors locked. They're not giving up the Victoria without a fight. Vanguard, take down that cruiser. Me, Vanguard. Let's regroup at the Victorum. The boarding team might need support. We're almost through those blast doors. No, oh, I a big fan. Thank you, thank you, Mr. Diban. Thank you, thank you. We've got another Imperial carrier. Make that three carriers. That's a lot. 
Get ready, everyone. We're in! Taking control now! Yeah. <laughs> that Star Destroyer's taken down its own carrier! What a sight! Yes! The ship is ours! You actually did it! And Project Starhawk has a Star Destroyer. I'll escort Talos Group to Safe Harbor. Great work. General Sadullo will be impressed. Wedge. Mm-hmm. <laughs> 